Blowing dust and sand that is developing out there. You know, uh, the wind started a little bit early out to the west, and that started to elevate the dust and the sand. Then those westerly winds have been transporting that dust and sand in our direction. Now we're starting to see it. The wind's getting a bit stronger. We're looking at 50-mile-an-hour winds uh, up until about 11 o'clock tonight. Then after 11 o'clock, the winds will gradually weaken. They're not totally going to shut off. And if you look at Las Cruces, I think stronger winds, as we've been anticipating, gusts around 55 for them until midnight. So an hour later, the winds will continue and then slowly weaken into tomorrow morning. We're going to be tracking a cold front coming in here, and that front will cool us down for the weekend, but the winds will not totally go calm tomorrow. Here's a look at our future track wind gust tracker. And you notice as we make our way into your Saturday, you can see how the winds, at least early on, not going to be too bad. They're going to have more of a northwesterly component to them, but the winds will pick up just a bit during the uh, late morning and into the afternoon hours. So like I said, the winds peaking out at 35 miles an hour for tomorrow. So if you do have any outdoor plans, kind of realize not going to be terribly windy, but the winds will be up from time to time. Then I think once we head into Sunday, a bit breezy, but still not too bad. We're talking about 35 tomorrow, 25 on Sunday, then 30 on Monday. Low and windy Monday, Tuesday in the breezy category. But notice how the winds switch direction. The winds will be turning more to the southeast and east next week, at least early on next week. So that will transport some moisture, some Gulf of Mexico moisture. Humidity level is going to go up just a bit. Uh, we will be looking at some more clouds moving in here and maybe a slight chance of seeing some rain during what is uh, typically, normally, our driest month of the year, the month of April. All right, here's your temperatures. And we're 92, 88 in Las Cruces. We have a temperature of 85 there in Deming and 83 up at the area lakes. If you look at our raincast over the next seven days, you'll notice I think maybe Wednesday, early Thursday, the potential will be there for about a 10% chance of seeing some light rain. All right, temperatures overnight tonight, 57 degrees. Again, the winds are going to continue up until late, 80 degrees tomorrow. So a cooler day coming our way. We're going to be looking at those winds northwesterly primarily. 49 for you guys in Las Cruces. Again, you're already seeing some dusty conditions. And your high temperature tomorrow at 77 degrees. Sunrise time will be at 629. All right, watch over the next several days. We hit 81 on Sunday, 76 even cooler once we head into Monday with the low-end winds. Then Tuesday and Wednesday, we will see some added clouds in the forecast. Maybe that slight chance of rain Tuesday, potentially into early Thursday. If the winds uh, stay a little bit more from a westerly direction, that will kind of dry us out pretty quick and send a lot of that moisture farther away towards our east. Overnight lows going to be in the upper 50s and right around 60 degrees. We'll take a break. Have a look at sports coming up.